Creepers on here, welcoming you back to Let's Play the Stew Boy Run of Super Mario Brothers 2. And, uh, this is my, <coughs> this is my PAX LP. So, of course, aside from having a PAX LP, I'm gonna have to record something else to put up in the days leading up to PAX. So, but I'm actually very happy to be doing this now, so that I don't have to worry about it later. I still have a couple of other real-life things I need to be taken care of, too, and I'm kind of nervous about that. But, uh, all will, all is well that ends well, right? Okay. Whoa, 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 take it easy, take it easy. How much of the mushrooms down there? <coughs> Let's see. Oh, no, it's not. How very nice of them to put it over there. There's a coin down there. It's the ship. Yeah, I remember the ship. Yes, I do. I remember that. Oh, good lord, what a short level. Holy crap. Oh, good lord, what is this? Extended boss music, that's kind of cool. Is there any other games ever done that? You know, played around with you by starting the boss music way before the boss? Oops. Uh, I'm not a big fan of these cannon guys. Thank you for dying. I'm not starting to worry. Hey, enjoy the breather. This is where that walkthrough said enjoy the breather. I don't remember if that was Nintendo Power or what, but it just said enjoy the breather. And that's where I learned what the word breather means. Yeah, I learned a lot of my words from those game guys, I tell you. Take a double coming. Oh, this is fun. There used to be a pattern in this, right? Up, down, up. Down, up, down, right? Oh, okay. Oh, it's cheese. And then they do it again, right? Oh. Okay, well, I guess you just have to react in time. <laughs> That's not too bad. I mean, I can react in time to that. As long as I don't go too fast. And now we have the whales, right? The whales. Oh, yeah. Well, I guess we get to whale on this level, then. Jeez. I said whale on this level, not whale on myself. <laughs> Will you love me forever? Charlie, of course I will. Even if we had to move up to Alaska and eat whale blubber for the rest of our lives, would you still love me? Of course. But I hope that never happens. Cut to six months later when Charlie's wife is with another man. But she said you'd eat whale blubber. Oh, well, she's gonna be eating blubber, all right, just as soon as I free Willie. Okay, yeah, go ahead. Oh, jeez, this is making me nervous, man. What the hell? This platforming all of a sudden has just gone from suck to blow. Uh, yeah, I remember if you had a star, you could run through the water spouts and they would deflate or disintegrate or whatever. I don't think there's anything here. No, okay. I don't care, about the, I don't care enough about the cherry. Jeez, this is really... Why is this so nerve-wracking? Holy crap, let me go up on top, man. The ice doesn't make me nearly as nervous as those one-platform-wide tails. Jeez, I didn't think that was going to be that nerve-wracking, but holy crap. I may need to enlist a better jumper to get through some of these later levels, I don't know. Ah, that's where the end of the level is, isn't it? No. Or is that the warp zone? That's probably the warp to level 6. Or world 6. Yeah, it must be, because we're still going here. <coughs> taking in a dump, and in a dump, and in a dump, and in a taking a dump on the toilet. Oh, that's right, you gotta leave this guy alive. I want it. I don't care. I want it. Crap. Yeah, killed Birdo with one hit. Just like when I killed Boom Boom with the star in Mario Bros. 3. There had to be another moment like that. I'm so happy. But considering all the difficulty I'm having, I'm kind of sort of blazing through this world. Maybe this is just a short world or something. But, I mean, we're at four minutes right now and already on World 3. What the hell is this? You can't put Bardo in the middle of a world. You can't just have a boss in the middle of the world. Oh, but guess what? That's right. This took me forever to figure out, too, as a kid. That you had to ride the egg across the sea. I just didn't know what to do. I was like, what do you do here? And I'm like, oh, should have been obvious, but... I mean, it's obvious to me now, sure, because I know what the solution is. 
And now, I'm even more mad that I had to record than I originally was mad about the situation that I wanted to tell you guys about. Sorry, I'm just quoting again from my secret playlist. Uh, I need to stop talking about that. And start, people start asking, what are you talking about when you refer to that? And trust me, that's something that does not need to be discussed. Bum, bum, holy moly. Okay, if it's World 4-3, it's probably going to be a long one. So let's get our... Let's, uh, let's pull up our bootstraps. Dude, stop doing that. I, I, need, I need a better jumper. These later worlds are kicking my ass, man. So far, this one isn't in anywhere near as bad as 3-3 was. Whoops. I'm sure the ice is slippery, but that's nothing to... Oh, boy. Oh, is this that one where you... Oh, jeez. This is that one where the mushroom is up there, isn't it? Oh, I knew it. How you get up there, I'll show you how. There's a flying carpet. Oh, it's right over there. Well, jeez. I don't even remember which door I came in. Oh, I guess we need to ride, huh? No, I didn't say... Shit. Holy crap! How did I survive that? Man, the controls are so loose on this. It's like you push it and it instantly starts going that way. Why is there a door and it goes down? Why does it keep doing that? I keep wondering. Oh, I see. Oh, that makes sense. Okay, this is getting a little tougher. Yeah, I see that now. That's what I should be doing, is using the key as a... weapon to get rid of these guys and simultaneously get rid of him. Dude, seriously? Thank you. I wish I could throw him up. Uh, thank you. All right, now we're getting somewhere here. Jeez, let the rest of those guys go on down. I don't know how far away he actually goes, but it seems like it's a few screens worth because it takes him a while to come back if you haven't picked up the key in a while. And we're back with the happy music again. What the hey, man? Oh, finally, the boss. You're not going to give me a heart or anything? I have to do this small? Don't go in there, Frosty. Ain't your time, man. Yeah, this boss is not too bad. Uh-oh. Just stay up here because he comes up just high enough that you can hit him. Oh no! Where do I start? Oh, right here, okay. Yeah, you can pick up this mushroom without actually losing your height or like falling off the platform, so. Um, so that's one thing. There we go. 
Oh, jeez, I almost did. I almost did the same thing I did last time. Here we go. Then he turns into these little guys, and this is surprisingly difficult to get out of these guys' way. So what you probably want to do is set up a nice little barrier. Try to get rid of at least one, but... And see, this is when Toad comes in handy because of how fast he picks the mushrooms up. And there you go. Do 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 Hell yeah! So that's it for World 4, guys. Sorry for the short video, but I didn't, ex I didn't expect that was going to be over so fast. Next time on Super Mario Bros. 2, we do World 5. See you guys later.